into our teams for this match. Let's do it. Away. Blue team coming up first. Player one on the blue team. We have got these guys are trolls. Red one what? is his name. He's going to be from Murrieta using the Black Knight. And of course, player two on the blue team, Red Two. Oh, man. Come on, guys. <laughs> from Menifee with Alona. Can you take a guess of what the name of player three on the blue team is? It's probably going to be Red Three, I'm guessing. How did you know Red Three incoming from Menifee as well with the Spartacus? And finally, rounding out the blue team, player number four on the blue team is going to be Frog. Ah. The mix-up. Right. The mix-up. Also from Menifee, going to be Rocket and Bonnie. And the coach for the blue team going to be Just Call Me Bow. So, oh. so just bow. Oh, yeah. Bow. All right. And now introducing their opponents on the red team. Player one, Wink from Texas. He's going to be using Alona. He's, so they've both got a healer. Player two on the red side. We've got Andrew from Lemur. Gonna be using Ann Bonnie. Player three on the red side, we've got BBKNA from PA with the BK, the Black Knight. And player four on the red team, we've got Kappa Beastie. I recognize that name. He's definitely been playing this game, but he's from Apple Valley. Gonna be rocking Rollins. And the coach for this red team, gonna be Bo. There it is. Our teams are up there, ready to go. You know, uh, best Black Knight NA back here again to show us this Black Knight. He's disguised himself as BBK ah, NA. You obviously. caught on. Obviously, the acronym for best Black Knight. This guy NA. yesterday, he was uh, wrecking people. He was dunking everybody with Black Knight, and so. Best it seemed Black like Knight. a troll at first, like, all right, he just wants to say, like, he's the right. best, whatever, but it's not going to be And then he the got, case. like, 15 kills or something absurd like that. We're like, uh, is he actually Maybe the best Black Knight? he is. NA? We'll have to see. Uh, and I recognized him because I was like, that guy looks familiar. From Philadelphia, BBK ah. NA, I was like, yep, we got him. So it looks like we're headed into our match here of Breakaway. You can see the Relic in the center. Both mm -hmm. teams going to try to take that to the opposite side of the arena here, score it themselves around. You need a couple of rounds to close this out. Wow, Spartacus on the blue team. Death Timer as his Whoa. initial purchase. It's an interesting one. So maxing out Death Timer uh, is, a, is an interesting choice because not only do you respawn faster, but anybody you happen to kill will have longer respawns. So if you're going to be a character who gets a lot of kills, it's a, it's a good choice. That's very, very interesting. I like that. Yeah. Here we go. Minecart Barrels goes out for the red team Rollins. And here comes a fight over this red damage buff. Yeah, big fight going down. Red team getting Pulled in by the Black Knight's ultimate on the blue team, and that is a dangerous place to be. Rollins sniping from behind, uh -oh. but look at the Relic being carried deep. Blue team does happen to have, uh, you know, members there, but the oh, Red team right about the score, and that was a pass to score it. That was great. Yeah, the Red team looks really, really synchronized here. Yeah, that was super smart. The Alona threw the Relic up, that was ran great. ahead, and said, hey, pass it to me. I'm open. There it is, mm -hmm. pass to Alona and the score. Yeah, while she was standing in the rail, you could still pass to her to right. get the score. Yeah, so great work, uh, team coordination from the red team to bring it together there. Already you can see, uh, you know, the coordination, and that's so important in this this game. Not only to have coordination in fights, uh, deciding where your buildables are gonna be, the objectives, stuff like that, but, you know, moving the relic, so important. Yeah, and red team and Bonnie going for the buildable destruction, so she's gonna be able to take out the blue team's buildables a lot easier now. And again, it looks like they're going to fight over this damage crystal. But Red Team and Bonnie just going to carry it already. Oh, they oh. don't even see her. Has the breakaway. No Hello. one's paying attention. Wait, somebody is hot on her Anyone trail. here? The Spartacus, McFly. but no. What's Come happening? Now. <laughs> Did you guys get that damage buff? Yeah, it lasts for the whole round. Oh, the round's over. Just like that. They're not looking at the objective. So many people focused on getting the damage buffs or fighting and stuff like that. And her team ended up getting the damage buff anyway. Yep. Man, this red yeah. team and Bonnie so focused on the objective. Good work to her running the relic when no one's paying attention. So here we go. Red team up a quick two rounds and match point for them. Yeah. More equipment yeah. getting purchased now. And red team and Bonnie, as you mentioned, still focusing on that buildable damage. So we'll see if she even has a chance to get rid of these buildables. As the uh, blue team has not really, you know, done much to fight the objective so far. 
Man, a red team's base is stacked. They've got three health shrines stacked up and three ballistas stacked up. So if Blue Tide makes this push right here. Oh, she's in jail. Got stuck in jail carrying the relic. She might actually go down. She's okay with health so far. Her team is no. there to back her up. Oh, wow. This is a bad fight so far. The red team looking a little bit on their heels, but those the ballistas, ballistas. There's so much damage, and Am Bonnie right next to them. Fire. Oh, there's gonna well. be a wipe in two seconds for Spartacus to respawn. Black Knight goes down. It could be oh, a wipe. So close. No, man. Even if he goes down here, Spartacus respawns, so they're okay. But that's where those buildables are so handy. Now they're going to be able to take out this damage crystal as well. So Red Team has the Relic. They're pushing on it. Meanwhile, Am Bonnie getting the damage crystal. Yeah, she's got the damage crystal. She's going to be making her way over to the team right now. Yeah, Red Team can coordinate together, group up. There's also buildable damage on that Am Bonnie, so these buildables will go down as well. Big fight, Black Knight on the blue team. Oh, he's one on four there, though. Yeah, he's got to be careful. He, despite having a lot of health, it's not an easy fight to take. Red Team looking to clear this Relic. Wow, great passing. And Blue Team now making their way out of there. Yeah, happen to clear the Relic away from their relay. That's the objective now. Blue Team, Black Knight with the big ultimate fighting it out. And Blue Team can now push the Relic. Oh, pass wow. over to Spartacus. Well, Spartacus lands on the spike trap, unfortunately, but he's got to be careful here. It's two on three and oh, oh, Alona jail in jail again. again. The big barrage from Rollins. And Alona has got to be careful. Her life just draining. She's got to clear the, the bars away, but gets taken out. Blue team trying to push this relic, although red team Rollins with the pass forward. Oh man, look out. And you can see this, those minecart pearls are starting to stack up too. Only blue two team. members on the blue team. This could actually be a wipe if they get both members before the respawns. Yeah, two seconds. Alone is back up. Yeah, the respawn so clutch, but the red team wow. has the relic on the steps already. Oh, and no, what? she happened to try to throw it past, but just tossed it into the arms of the waiting red team Alona. That was ridiculous.